Hi everyone, my name is Felix from Shop3D and I'm the Senior Application Specialist here at Shop3D. Today we get to do some hands-on 3D scanning with the Einscan Pro HD. So let's get scanning. The Pro HD is a more advanced 3D scanner that can be used in both handheld and fixed mode. It actually has three scanning modes, fixed mode, HD handheld scan, and rapid handheld scan. Now before you jump in and start scanning, we gotta make sure that your scanner is calibrated. Simply follow the on-screen instruction to get the scanner tuned in. Now I know this sounds complicated, but you don't have to worry about any of that because the firmware and the software will take care of all the calibration, tracking, and aligning of your object. If you are traveling with a scanner, you'll want to calibrate before every scan. This readjusts the scanner to the new environment. At this point, you're ready to go, but you'll need to select the scanning mode. Let's talk about those. Fixed mode works with the scanner mounted in one position, pointing directly at your scanner. Often, the object is positioned on some kind of automatic turntable, like the one that comes with the industrial pack. But it can also be a cheap lazy Susan from the dollar store. This mode will give you the greatest overall detail and accuracy. It also allows you to take your object and turn it in many different ways on the Lazy Susan so that you can get at all the important angles. Fixed mode is ideal for small to medium sized objects. It works a lot like the Einscan SE, which is the Pro HD smaller scale desktop counterpart made for more simple applications. If you haven't seen that video already, go ahead and check the link in the description below. But what if you needed to scan larger objects? Like we talked about before, there are two handheld modes that you can use for that. In handheld mode, you have the flexibility to move around your object. The obvious advantage is that you can scan larger objects. In HD mode, you get a tight point cloud and a more detailed scan, but this comes at a cost of speed, since you have to move slower to gather more data points. If you need something scanned quickly, rapid scan is your other option. Rapid scan is exactly what it sounds like. It creates a pretty sparse point cloud data and the accuracy isn't as great, but overall you can scan faster and get a good impression of your object. If you're gonna reverse engineer the part anyway or just need some rough dimensions, this is the mode you want to be using. Hey! Now the Pro HD is pretty good on a variety of different surfaces. However, really shiny surfaces and glossy surfaces don't really get picked up that well. This is where the ASAP spray comes in. ASUB is a special spray that goes on top of your part. Once it dries, it creates a smooth, chalky white finish. This will allow the scanner to pick up the more difficult surfaces from your parts. You can use the washable ASUB that comes off with a damp paper towel or the disappearing ASUB spray that evaporates after two to five hours completely. And that's all I got for you today. If you found this video useful, drop us a like and subscribe. And as always, if you have any questions, give us a call or drop us a comment below. Until next time, I'm Felix and this is Shop3D.